And it turns out it's a really bad idea. Now, if there are physicians or oral health experts out there that strongly believe in the use of hydrogen peroxide rinses or gargling with it to promote oral health for any reason, let me know in the show note captions. I don't wanna go against any of those recommendations, but this now considered kind of old school recommendation of creating one's own mouthwash with a little bit of baking soda, some hydrogen peroxide and water, does not seem like a good idea, not just based on my experience, but every one of the dental professionals that I spoke to. That said, it does seem that creating a high salt solution, okay, so taking some salt, putting it into water, dissolving it, and then finding the point at which it won't quite dissolve because the concentration of sodium is just high enough, and using that as, of course, not something to swallow, but rather as a dental rinse, so putting your mouth and swishing it around, and then spitting it out, and it's gonna taste very salty. And then taking a swig of water, you know, just plain water, and then swishing it around and then spitting it out. 